Hey everybody, I'm gonna make um, creamy classic mashed potatoes for you tonight. Um, I know that this may seem um, out of the ordinary because I do like to cook from scratch, but I think Idaho Spuds has got it going on since 1933. And who's gonna question that when you put this beautiful um, plate of potatoes in front of them? I actually got this recipe from my girlfriend, Andrea, who feeds a crowd a ton um, through Young Life, she's always fixing a big buffet of food for kids and tons of tons of people at her house. And she did this for us once um, when we went over for dinner. And I thought, what a great idea. And it's, it's perfect. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull it all together. Then when I put it in the microwave, I'm going to stop the video. Then I'll pick it back up and show you how to dress it up, put it in the oven, and make it look like you worked all day on cooking, peeling, and mashing potatoes. So... Two cups of water, one cup of milk, get a microwave safe bowl because we're not even cooking this on the stove. It's all microwavable. It takes five minutes to cook in the microwave. Put a couple tablespoons of butter, pinch of salt, mix it up. Looks like um, a soupy mess. And when you Get it out of the microwave. I'm gonna put it in this casserole dish and dress it up and you will be surprised at how good it is. Okay, we've gotten the mashed potato mixture out of the microwave and this is what it looks like. You see the butter's on top. I'm just gonna mix it together, make it creamy. Try to get all the lumps out of it. I'm gonna add a cup of Colby Jack cheese and some ground pepper. Mix it together. Now I've got my little casserole dish here where I've already sprayed it with Pam. And I'm going to put the mashed potatoes in the pan. So that was a total in the microwave of five minutes that I cooked these potato flakes with water and milk. Just follow the recipe on the box for whatever you're doing whatever portion you need. I mean, what a great way to feed a lot of people, especially if you have hungry boys. It's inexpensive and it tastes great. So, now that I've got that there, I'm ready to go back in the, um, to go in the oven. I'm gonna top it with some, another little bit of Colby Jack cheese. And I always like a little bit of Parmesan on top just to get it crispy and brown. So I'm gonna add my Parmesan that's shredded. And I'm gonna put this in the oven at 350 for maybe, I don't know, maybe five or 10 minutes. When that is done, you are gonna have the best mashed potatoes ever. Tonight we're having um, green beans on the cooktop and some um, the mashed potatoes and meatloaf, which I've got a, a video coming for later. So here's a great little shortcut for mashed potatoes for a crowd. I hope you enjoy.